So I've been doing Stitch Fix for nine months now. I think I started in November, November, December, January, February, March, April, May, June, July. Yeah, yeah, nine months now. And um, I've liked it for the most part. Each month is different. Uh, some months are better than others. But I thought since I was sharing my Ipsy bags, I would share my stitch fixes as well. And this is my stitch fix from last month. And what I really like about stitch fix is, in addition to the clothing that they send, um, they send you this little style guide that uh, shows you different ways to style the outfits that they or the clothes that they send you. So that's helpful for me because I don't know how to style anything. Um, but first we have the Riley Pintuck Detailed Silk Blouse by Collective Concepts. And I really, really loved this blouse. It's light and flowy and has these great little details on the shoulders. And um, so this was a winner for me. I really, really enjoyed it. It was easy to dress up, easy to dress down. Um, I paired it with um, some chinos first and then paired it with um, a skirt that was sent in the same stitch fix um, that I sadly didn't keep, but we'll get to that later. Um, actually, we're going to do it next. So, um, next is the Kira Printed A-Line Skirt by Artie Style. And I really liked the way that this skirt fit. It, I've had some trouble with Stitch Fix and the skirts being really, really long or not fitting right at my waist properly. Uh, and this skirt fit just right, but the pattern was jarring and I didn't keep it but um, I was pleased that uh, I was pleased with the fit. So next we have the Galen laser cut dress also by Collective Concepts. Ultimately this dress just felt too heavy. There was too much material and it's hot here in Louisiana and I need flowy and airy and breathable and this just wasn't it just wasn't it. Very cute, very um, very work appropriate, I guess, and also Sunday brunch appropriate. Um, can be dressed up, dressed down, throw a sweater on, throw some heels on, either way. Um, but it was just such a heavy fabric. Um, I just, I couldn't do it. Next is the Merriam Knit Dress by Market and Spruce. And upon initial sighting of it, uh, I was not so sure. It felt really heavy. Um, but when I put it on, I wore it around the house for about an hour or two. It was really, really comfortable. Moves really well. Very flattering uh, to my to my body shape, which is nothing up top at all. But again, I just I hated the pattern. I hated all the stripes. Um, I wish, wish, wish they'd had it in a solid color. Um, last and not least. My favorite in this in this stitch fix was the Alicia Buttonback knit top by Paper Moon. I will never be able to wear this top around my cats ever. They will they will put so many pulls in it, but it is um, a knit fabric and it has these adorable snaps in the back that serve no purpose whatsoever. But I love it, and the the top is so comfortable, so breathable. I loved it. I loved it. I absolutely kept it. So that was my July stitch fix. Um, my August stitch fix should be here in a week, maybe, and I'll share it with y'all then. And the way stitch fix works is you pay a $20 styling fee per month for five articles of clothing. They also do shoes and jewelry. And anything you, you keep, that $20 goes towards that purchase. So I think it's a really good deal and um, I haven't tried any other clothing subscription services so I can't really speak on that but I've been pretty happy with Stitch Fix so I recommend it. Thanks again. Bye.